Okay, here's a quick video on what I want you to do. Here is a sample of the LED. I mean, here's a sample of the bulb in the socket, right? That you removed. And you get your LED. And you put it inside. And you um, put it like this and you put it into the hole. And you twist it, lock it, and you say you turn it on and it didn't work and you took it out. And what I want you to do was take this out. Hold this in the same position, don't flip this, flip this, and then put it in, and then put it back into the hole and try it. That You said that thing also didn't work, right? And so you see this two, you see those connectors in the bottom, those gold connectors? It has these little pins have to line up with those holes. So, so sometimes you have, what you have to do is you have to take this, and um, kind of push it towards the sides okay like so like this like put it up like that so it's kind of blurry you see like I flared them out a little bit and I'm gonna try to make sure that they line up into the hole but touch those contacts in there you know what I mean and then try it Right, before you want to see, um, or what you can do is you can just take a 12 volt source, um, like a 9 volt battery. Right now I'm, I have, I don't have, I'm gonna use something else, something similar to a 9 volt battery. But you can, you see those these two contacts, one in here and one in here. You can touch them with power. You know, what? I'm gonna do this and do this side. You see how they light up? Again, if I were to flip this around and you know I give power here and negative here and positive here, of course it's not gonna work. But I'm gonna flip it and this right here, I'm putting positive, and this right here I'm putting negative. You see how it turns on? So I know that this, you know, it's right now the contact is good, it's not a problem. So when I put it in here and it doesn't work, then I know then I gotta flip this, you know what I mean? Because I know for sure right now there's a solid, con you know, it, it's continuous current is gonna flow through from here to here since everything is touching and it works when I put power to it. Basically, when you put it into the socket, these two contacts here, up here and down here gets made contact with the board and it powers the LED, right? Try that, if you have a 12 volt source, you know, just get two wires and then touch one here, one here. I'm using like a power battery pack here, that's what I'm using to get the power from, and it should work.